Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Caves of Cud. We are Yishwayun, the Psychic Apostle. We are on our way to Grit Gate. We traded with a merchant we found uh, when we were lost, and we got our bearings because of that. Now we are going to continue traveling towards Grit Gate. What is here? Dar. Oh, yeah. An Ikonin Legendary Salamander. We're not, we don't care too much about those. Oh, we got lost again. Just a bunch of uh, Snapjaws, though. Uh, I'm pretty sure that that was our Apple Farmer's daughter that just lit that um, block of tiles on fire. Pretty sure. Does it say that you have that ability? No. You are wearing some stuff. Oh, you got, you got your iron shorts were there. Uh, ooh, and we have um, a Kala Snapchat Bear Baiter. The thing is... Uh, I am pretty happy with our team right now. I could replace the Apple Farmer's Daughter, but she's actually doing a lot more damage than I would have thought. And she's leveling up, getting new abilities as she levels up. I think that's what this fire is. So I'm just going to go ahead and try to kill this legendary scap, uh, Snapjaw, which, you know, I hit him, uh, but you're still not too hurt. Do I burgeon? I don't think so. Too dangerous. I could equip my flamethrower. That would be fun. But no. I think we're going to be able to kill him just fine. Uh, someone has an electric weapon. It's probably you. Uh, we, yeah, you're holding an artifact. Um, I could intimidate you. Or uh, not intimidate, but medicine stare. All right, now you're scared. Hey, okay, we leveled up. Since we leveled up, Psychic Glimmer. What is this? Your Psychic Glimmer represents how noticeable you are in the vast Psychic ether, ether. As your mental mutations increase in level, so does your Psychic Glimmer and the frequency, strength, and number of those who desire to absorb your mind. Currently, you are being watched and pursued by Ospreys, Ptoes servants, and birds of Psychic Prey who pluck larval espers from their egg sacs. That doesn't sound terrifying at all. Um, because our, I guess our, our mental mutations just keep going up and up. Um, why are our skills at all these negatives? Um, oh, we're dazed. Something dazed us. Okay. We got skill points. Um, I think we save up for inspiring presence, though. It's going to be nice for us. Okay. Can't undermine yet. Are we still dazed? I think so. All right. Can't undermine yet. Uh, we are a little hurt. I think I'm going to run away here. Where we can't be seen. Uh, we are pretty hurt. Um, I'm suddenly terrified. Uh, I could sunder the mind of this little thing. I think I'm going to do it. Kind of a waste, but I just want to... Uh-oh. Oh, this is bad. The thing is, I don't have any salves or anything. Um, okay, I can intimidate. And I will. All right, now you're scared and running away. I'm going to also run away. Sprint. Try to stay out of your line of sight. And uh, rest still healed. All right, someone killed it. We got a better reputation with the Farmer's Guild. Better reputation with the Villagers of Ekalil. Where is that? And we're fully healed. Our companions did a good job. I assume we got reputation for that. Yeah, 50-50. That's it. Not even that tough. But we're going to get your artifacts. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm just not going to pick up a lot of stuff now. What do we have? Sturdy leather apron? Meh. Meh. 
All right, where did you die? Where did you die? Where did that creature die? You have an artifact. There's an artifact on the ground somewhere. Up here? There it is. An Electro Bow. Uh, replace the cell. Remove it. Take that Electro Bow. We might want to wield it. Um, sure, I'll take that. And a high capacity chem cell was in it. That's cool. So the Electro Bow does 1d6 damage and has, I think the 10, is that range? Maybe that's range. Not penetration. So 1d6 compared with our Desert Rifle, which is 1d8. I think I'll keep the rifle for now. Okay. All right. Happy with how that went. So you can see, like, I very got very close to death there. But um, fortunately, we have enough little get-out-of-jail cards that, uh, that work pretty well for us. They're not foolproof. But... They work. Other cap. Does everyone have a helmet? Whoops. Do all of you have helmets? You are wearing a leather cap. You are wearing a leather cap. You are wearing... Nope, you don't have one. All right, Mayor. There you go. Here, take that shawl. Okay. Uh, are we still, um, dazed? No, we're not dazed. Why do we have... Oh, yeah, that's, that is our natural strength and agility. Has it gone up? I think it has gone up one each. Ego is awesome. Would love our intelligence to go up. Okay. Copper nugget. All right, we discovered what? The tract of, tract of what? The tract of. Okay, this is the tract of. That's what this area is called. The tract of. Just a table, just a table. Who lives here? What is this place? I don't want to have to bust down that fence. Uh, you, who are you? Just a pig farmer. This is a pig farm. Uh, you have a copper nugget. I'll trade you something for that. What do we have that we can sell you? I wasn't picking anything up. Um, well, we have too much water. I'll just take it from you. Yeah. Okay. All right, we're not lost anymore. We can just leave. And head to Great Gate. Cool. All right, here we are. This place is usually filled with more of those little mirth worms and also robots. Uh, we should be able to open this door because if you remember, we have a... We have a... Where is it? Maintenance security card. We can just open yellow doors, which is beautiful. We can't open... Oh, we can open red doors too, apparently. I am going to disassemble all this scrap that we find. Excellent. And as we level up our tinkering, we'll be able to build more stuff. I love being able to open those. Uh, okay, albino ape is neutral. We already have a, a um, uh, simian. Yeah, a simian uh, companion. We don't need another one. Aha! A robot! A robot! Obviously, uh, sundering the minds of robots don't work. Um, so, maybe I should equip the Electro Bow for you. Or I just leave you to my companions. That's probably a better idea. Um, I can also just fire. Yeah, I already damaged you there. Um, our Apple Farmer's daughter isn't the best person to fight you. Uh, where are my companions? Companions. 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 
There you are. Hello. Where's my baboon? There you are. Baboon. What are you doing? Baboon. Oh, you have mumble mouth. I think what you... Remember he was itchy before? Now he has mumble mouth. I don't know what that does. Hopefully it just means, like, makes you not be able to speak or lose ego or something like that. Okay, that gorilla is helping us out here. Is our mayor in trouble? Oh, our mayor is in trouble. Mayor, run. Baboon, come help. Yeah, there you go, baboon. Yes! Baboon! You gained a level. Excellent. And our mayor is alive. Uh-oh. That is an office of the Sightless Way. Uh, they have psychic attacks. But so do we. Dead. Sweet. Okay, I'm, I'm a little worried. Why is the mayor, like, running out? You're badly wounded. You should heal yourself. Where's our apple farmer's daughter? Okay. Yeah, just... No, just quit running around. Stay in one place and heal yourself. Okay, you're, you're getting healed, walking around. I just, like, want to stay by the mayor. Okay, let's heal up. Oh, I'm healed. I'm totally healed. Is that centipede? Yeah, you are hostile. Fire at you from a distance. Did I kill it? I killed it. Not the best shot, but, uh, you know, I'm okay. All right, our baboon, I think, is fine. Our mare maybe should get better equipped or something. I don't know. Just level up some more. I don't know. Oh, there's the apple farmer's daughter. All right, there we are. We're all we're, we're all a group again. Uh, we're going to want to go down. It's a few floors down to get to the Barathromites. But we might as well search all this out. See what we can find. There's another droid. Um, come on, baboon. The baboon is just a powerhouse. What is this? A little graffiti? Ship continues and... That's just a little flavor, I think. I don't think it really does anything. Wait, what? That was weird. Door wouldn't open. Can I open this? I cannot open the green door. So maybe... Yellow opens red and yellow. Maybe like red's the lowest, then yellow, then green. If you get a green card, you can open green or any of them. Maybe that's how it works. Oh. Die, novice of the sightless way. An Issachari Sunveil. And a steel warhammer. Not a bad weapon at all. I'll take that Sunveil. All right. Fire. Fire. Oh, did I hit... I didn't mean to hit you, Baboon Queen. I'm sorry. Yeah, go. Go kill it. Nice. So much XP from that. Uh, that hermit doesn't hate us, even though I'm pretty sure we did something that lowered our reputation with hermits at some point. But we are hungry. Let's make camp. All right. And I think we can go down now. Are you okay? Yeah, just mumble mouth. And I guess our the mayor probably has mumble mouth as well. No, you're just still itchy. I bet you're going to get it, though. I bet you're going to get that mumble mouth. Oh, I missed this chest, didn't I? Oh, no, I didn't. I got it. All right, let's go down. Okay. Killed something here. How's our mayor? He's doing fine. Take the toolkit. Take all this stuff. Come at me. Come at me, centipede. Okay. <laughs> the baboon's just, just better than we are. Um, why would I fight it when the baboon can fight it, right? Where'd the mare go? Oh, come on, baboon. This is all you. There you go. Oh, Baboon, I love you. Um, baboon. Baboon, help fight the way droid. Uh-oh. There you go. Uh, 
Okay, I think the mayor killed it. And we leveled up. Did the mayor kill it? I don't know who killed the Electrofuge. But we leveled up. Um, we still can't level up our mutations. But we could get a new mutation. We can also get another attribute point. Tempting to get intelligence to make it plus two. Uh, I think we get Inspiring Presence to embolden our companions. Now, if we want to get more Tinkering... Right, to get Tinkering 2, we need 23 Intelligence. Which, uh, we only have 19 right now. Do we slowly start working that up? Or do we continue to put it into Ego? I mean, your Ego's pretty darn good right now. I think I would like more intelligence at this point and more skills to boot. This will make it plus two, which gives us more skill points. Um, cool. But I think it's 100 to get to the next tinkering thing. Or, oh, it's 200 to get to tinkering too. We want repair, I think. I would like that. Um, and do we want another mutation? I think so. Why not? Mass Mind. You tap into the aggregate mind and steal powers from other espers. It refreshes all mental mutations. Uh, large cooldown. Small chance each round for another esper to steal your powers. Seekers of the Sightless Way like us less, but we don't really like them to begin with. Light Manipulation. You manipulate light to your advantage. You produce ambient light with a radius of 4. You can focus it into a laser beam, which does damage. Ambient light radius increases by 1 every 15 rounds. Huh. We might do that. Stunning force invokes a concussive force in a nearby area, throwing enemies backward and stunning them. Creatures are pushed away from the center of blast, stunned, and dealt crushing damage. I think... I mean, all of these are good. Mass Mind, I feel like, would be better if we had more, more offensive things, which both of these are. This does very little damage. It's a big area. Does it always stun? You know what? I think we have enough. Um, I think doing something like this when we're in trouble is probably better than burgeoning for us at this point. I think I will get Stunning Force. Light Manipulation sounds cool, but I think I will get Stunning Force. I'm being watched. It's a familiar feeling. When someone has watched you in the past, when it's light that's betrayed your presence, you made a friend of the darkness. You pulled your hat brim low over your eyes. You stepped behind the cover of a thatched wall. But those who watch you now watch in spite of such simple obstructions. Their sight isn't mediated by the rays of a gleaming star or torch, but by something much older. If there are ways to conceal yourself from these seeing eyes, if there are new kinds of darknesses to befriend, you know nothing of them. Our psychic glimmer is getting hot. Oh boy. All right. Um, abilities. Stunning force. We'll put that on nine. Not that I'll remember that. Uh, out of curiosity. Out of curiosity. At this level, it does 1d5 damage increments. Which isn't terrible. Okay. Actually, now that I'm looking at this, Sunder Mind does how much damage? 2d8 damage right now. 2d8 damage. Beguiling does... Um, oh, gets bonus hit points. Um, burgeoning. It just lowers the cooldown of it. And I think it does make more powerful plants. Yeah, next level you get even more powerful plants. Temporal Fugue. Oh, right. I almost forgot about Temporal Fugue. We should be using that more. Uh, this makes more copies. Oh, and increases the duration of it. Cool. All right, we'll continue. Uh, whoa. Uh, baboon, help us out. Help us out, Baboon. Thank you. Oh, that was a novice of the sightless way. 
We got hurt. Let's rest. Um, a steel vine reaper, I'll take. We'll disassemble this. Sandals of the river wives. These increase movement speed. Um, I like your crocosins, but I'll take them. Spark tick. That was a spark tick that I think the apple farmer's daughter killed. I really wish we... Can we give the apple farmer's daughter a name? I would love to do that. I should just call her something. Come on, baboon. Help us out. Yeah. And uh, the baboon gained another level. Can't open that door. Wait, yes, I can. It's red. It's green. I can't open. Okay. Nothing, nothing behind it anyway. That's the downside of procedural generation. Sometimes... There are just doors and there's nothing behind them. Uh, let me give you some stuff. Uh, is that it? Yeah, okay. Actually, you know what? Give me some of that back. I don't think you're... I think our mayor is using an iron... Yeah, an iron mace. And a carbide dagger, but... Let's give you, instead of that iron mace... A steel warhammer. How about that? And... Apple Farmer's Daughter? Should really name you something. If you can think of a good name, let me know in the comments for the Apple Farmer's Daughter. And we'll just call her that. Um, steel Vine Reaper. How about that? Because I'm pretty sure you were using... A... Iron short sword. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, we can't open that door. Oh, that is a slug snout. Those are dangerous. I'm going to sunder its mind and kill it. Oh, that was just a boar, not a slug snout? Maybe it was. Uh, yeah, baboon, you go first. Well done. I love this baboon. Um, baboon, good. And our mayor did did a good job over here too, killing this boar. Can we do a good job? Nope, run away. <laughs> Heal up. Oh, a spark tick. Uh, sunder its mind. All right. Heal. Uh, someone else kill it. Okay. We're healed. Spark ticks are dead. Oh. Heal up. I'm getting so much XP by doing very little. Just by having awesome companions. Oh. Uh, I'm running back. Uh, our torch went out. This wouldn't be an issue if I had taken that other mutation. I'm not using our muta- Our, uh... Our, um... Mutations enough. I should be using the uh, the force thing now more often. Now that we can use it. Wooden arrows. Um, like I could use it here. Sure, why not? What just happened? We stunned everybody. I guess the center of it is not. You got lightly damaged. Ouch. All right, heal up. That was that did not work out well. I got a chem cell out of it. Okay. Um. All right, I think we pretty much searched this level. Let's go down to the nearest staircase down. Uh, actually, there is some area over here. Yeah, not really. Down. Uh, I'm gonna move towards the baboon. Hey, leveled up again, because everyone's awesome. Especially our baboon friend. Yep, we still can't up these yet. Maybe next level, because these are, say, six, and our ego was plus six. Psychic Glimmer continues to go up. Uh, but we have skill points. 140. I think I'm going to repair. I'm going to get repair. Mainly because 
I'm sick of having um, these broken artifacts. Give those to me. Repair. Oh, I need to understand it first, but I can't understand it until I repair it. Ugh. Why is life so difficult? Um, sometimes you can find things that automatically identify things for you, like um, some kind of artifact will do that. Uh, how's our... All right. Yeah, this one weighs a bunch. I'll give that back to you. Uh, take this Iskari Sunveil, too. Do we have anything else? Okay. Uh, we have oil over here. I guess I'll take it. Okay. Uh, what is up with you? Oh, the apple farmer's daughter is no longer average, but now easy. Uh, the apple farmer's daughter is easy. Uh, so she used to be normal. I guess we have leveled up a little higher than she has, maybe? I think when she levels up again, though, hopefully it'll say normal again. I don't know. I like having her. She's very. She's been very useful, more so than the mayor. Baboon, kill him. Okay. Why is she green, though? Oh, we... She's still... Oh, she's emboldened. She's emboldened. Wait a minute. I just realized that that skill I took... Um, inspiring Presence... I thought this was an activated skill. But it's a passive skill. All of my friends are emboldened now. That is awesome. That is very awesome. Our mum, including our mumble-mouthed uh, baboon. All right, a lot of loot here. A lot of a uh, scrap, I should say. Oh, uh, I will go ahead and sunder your mind. There's the other stair down. Uh-oh. You're bleeding. Oh, you're okay. Yeah, the baboon killed you. All right. Uh, run away. All right, I'll help kill the amoeba. Good. Um, can I sunder your mind? I can. All right, heal up. Uh, so there's the downstairs. Ooh, are you... You are hostile. You're in a defensive stance. You have a carbide longsword. I will sunder your mind. Uh, did not kill you, but you were badly wounded. Oh, there's a um, way droid right next to me. I just realized. All right, finish him off, baboon. All right, I think you did it. Heal up. Look at this. Steel boots, steel plate mail... Carbide longsword, sh steel shield. All right, baboon, you are getting these things. They're too heavy for us. Um, yeah, I'll give you that carbide long carbide longsword too. I'm gonna wait a few turns so you can equip it. What are you wearing now? Yep, you're wearing the steel plate mail and the boots, and the longsword. What did you drop? Two handed steel battle axe. Oh, and the shield. I should give you the shield. Although, I feel like maybe the shield should go to the mayor. Will you use the shield if I give it to you? Wait a few turns. Are you using it? You are not. What is this? Just a hermit with a short sword? All right, what about now? I waited a bunch of bunch of turns. No. All right, if you don't want that shield, I will give it to... Um, what about the uh, Apple Farmer's Daughter? Will you use it? Wait a few turns. Take a look at you. No. All right. 
then I will give it to my baboon. See if the AI makes you use it instead of uh, one of your weapons. I mean, I certainly don't want you to die, so if you can get better AC, that's great. Yeah, you're not using it. All right, whatever. Oh, ah. I got a little... Uh, sometimes the screen does that. That's an in-game thing. It's not like, don't adjust your televisions. Run away. Okay. Heal up. Just rest till healed. What is this? Molten wax. Oh. All right, we don't have any active effects. That usually comes from a mutation. Um, like, not a mutation. A, uh... Um, you know how, like, people, like, we have itchy skin? So, mumble mouth, I've seen, I've gotten, like, a, uh, a disease, basically, that makes something grow on you that drips molten wax. Maybe someone else had it? It's called something. Yeah, wax flab. Our mayor has wax flab. So, the baboon got mumble mouth. The mayor has wax flab. And wax flab, I think it prevents you from equipping something. I can't remember what. You're wearing gloves. You're wearing a cap. I don't know, but something. Maybe something on your back. Maybe you can't put anything on your back. I don't know. But that's what this wax is. And you're dripping it everywhere. I might as well collect it. Even though it's disgusting. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, again, those are things that can be cured. Uh, if you, I think there's a book that you can find uh, that will tell you how to cure those things. That's a betel in there. A sparking betel. Oh. And a rifle turret. Run away. No, don't. Mayor, you're going to die. Baboon. Okay, you ran away. Good. Heal up. Um, I'm going to telepathy with that beetle. Beetle? Because you can talk to them. No, uh, just just do it. Petty mortal, bring me six concentrated still beard gland pastes, and I will reward you with a peculiar contraption. All right, we've noted it. Oh, we killed the turret. Great. Ring mail. Take all this stuff. Uh, I should really put in a cut. Let me get all this treasure. Um, take that ring mail. Makes sense for you to have it. Oh, we got 194 lead slugs. There's the chest. Open it up. Blood slugs. Vine wafer. A musket. Silver nugget. Silver nugget's great. You know what? I'm just going to disassemble this musket. Cool. All right. And that was a green door. We can't open that. Okay. All right. Uh, and I'll collect the molten wax dripping from our mare. All right. Um, oh, and so I don't forget, I will uh, make camp and eat. We got a little quickness. I'm pretty happy with how things are going. I'm, we're going to get down to uh, to the Barathromites pretty soon. Definitely next episode. And then uh, from there, I think we'll probably go to the Six Day Still. Um, we'll see. I really enjoyed playing with you today, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.